evening, good evening, good evening, morning, afternoon, night, wherever you are, whatever time it is. Hiya, hiya. This is Robbo Lands Vids. I'm Robbo, Rob Wheatley. Uh, this is Disgrace Lands, a small thing that orbits somewhere in the northeast of Essex in the UK. Any further that way, and we're in the water. Any further that way, civilization. I know it's not a very nice choice, is it? Um, now, if I can get this right, if I don't get this right, then you know it's, it's practice time. I'm trying to hold a pick correctly instead of holding it with two fingers like that. I normally do. That's the thing with this light; it's really annoying. Now, massive great monster pick thing. Um, I'm trying to hold it properly with one finger, and one thumb. You know. Completely buggered that up. It's one, two, three, 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 four, one, two, three, four. That's it. That's an exercise I came up with um, and gave it to a couple of students this week. Um, I think it's just a major or major scale with a flattened seventh, it might be. That came to light earlier. I don't know what it is. It's just diddly 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 did. And um, several ideas in this. And this came because I grabbed a flat pick. I don't don't often play with one. I normally use a, a thumb pick, one of them, or no thumb pick and just these fingernails there, those three. That's just used as ballast and occasionally rhythmic content by muting and stuff like that, apparently. But uh, So, flat picking is something which is a bit of a gap in my... I don't do it very often, so I tend to get sloppy. And this is something... I was just playing something the other day, and... Um, it was going from one string to another. And I was missing it. And farting it and, and catching that string badly. And it was these little transitions, and I was... Not happy, you know, not happy at all. So I just sort of started. Um, and the reason it's got like four sets of triplets, da 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 and then two fours, da 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 is because I put it together and that's the way my brain works. I can't just do fours and things. But it makes it more interesting and it keeps the timing, you know. And it's all based, um, I'm using quite a fat pick as well, because the other thing was I found went through a variety of picks and found that the pick tone he said the T word he said the T word the pick tone one of these is very very sort of clicky and that sort of thing you know it's sort of and it was whereas this you get a hefty thwomp when you hit it right um, Um, and you can feel it in your fingers a bit more and it helped me realise when I was hitting the string correctly and when I was bumming it and buzzing it and all that sort of stuff. You can almost hear it sort of go boom, 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 when you get it right. Do it again, just like boom, boom. Oh, I'm bugging it up. Dave, special effects. Boom, boom, boom. Um, yeah, so we're going for alternate picking up, down, up, down all the time, every single one. Naughty there, and we're keeping all of our fingers where they should be. Four, three, two, one, four, three, two, one. We slide down there so everything's in the right place. But I just kept playing that, and it just stuck in my freaking head. Hang on, I'll get the tab for you. You can see the tab. Any of those that are interested, I'll hold it up and you can do a screenshot or whatever it is you, you want to do. Um, yeah, really simple. That's the original because it's got colors on it. Right? I'll go to the original away. There's the, the tab. The light, the one, the, the numbers right across the top here are finger numbers, and then these are all the little groups of three. And a big load of eight here or fours. And one on the end. I'll just hold it there as still as I can for a minute. You do a screen, you know, pause it or whatever. All right. 
it doesn't look right. That looks oh, because it's all reversed on the thing here. It looks backwards to me when I'm looking at it. But that's you know, it says I, I've written aim for total consistency of both timing and tone and volume. That's also really important. This is all about cleaning up sloppiness as much as it is about getting dexterity in your fingers and um, and getting used to playing around with. Uh, what's basically a scale, but instead of just going just going through it all I like to introduce a couple of extra elements to make it a bit more interesting, you know? So we could just have some people going, you know But you know, with a bit of Been a long day, sorry, I'm not but it's one, two, three, 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 four, one, two, three, four, pin. I think it's got a nice on the end. And, and it's a movable, I think it's I think it's a made I think Oh I don't know. No, I think it is, I think it's just a um E major scale. I'm counting the wrong one as a seventh, I'm a bloody fool. Yeah, I think it's an E major scale, but basically, there's a starting point on your B string. Um, and so as a way of cheating, and if you want to play that in a different key other than E, look where the B is on the 12th fret, look at the string next to it, it's an E, right? So if I want to play that somewhere else, work. if I want to play it in a C, work out where the E string is, at a C, which is there, and you start on the B next to it, and you'll be in a C, I imagine. Someone will probably write and tell me I'm completely wrong, because I don't know, I haven't tried it, but it seemed to work. And um, at the end of one of the lessons, we just started jamming. And I started just playing some cowboy, that was a Tourette's twitch, boop, boop, boop. just in case uh, the guy who requested it, <laughs> not requested it, hey, twitch of the week, man, <laughs> just have a really big one, halfway through a conversation, so if you get what you're talking about, um, I just started messing about, but that was some cowboy chords, because again, it's going back to basics is always a good thing, no matter how long you've been playing, because we tend to get sloppy, and that's what this whole exercise was about for me, and then it became a lesson for two other people this week. Um, one of the guys I tagged it onto the beginning of another lesson uh, and the other guy just didn't want too much for his brain this week because in the middle of a load of exams and all this sort of stuff so we stuck with that and we just really nailed it but if you start getting that consistency and that flow and all that sort of stuff that I talk about quite a lot relax, confidence without buggering it up like I did um, you'll be better for it and it just makes you listen to what you're doing and tighten things up and work with different timings and that was the thing we, we then started jamming some cowboy chords and he said oh I like that and he, he took over playing the chords and I just did some lead stuff and for the most of it I was just doing very basic sort of simple more like vocal sort of stuff you know la 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 I said a dilly 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 and then at the end of it I chucked that entire riff in and it just fit really really nicely so it's you know you wouldn't want an entire guitar solo made up of that because it is basically just running up and down scales with a bit of twiddly 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 but you know makes it more exciting doesn't it anyway i need a beer i need a beer i need a beer i've got this one i don't need a beer i just want one i've got this one citra and i read about this i had some of this yesterday and i hadn't read the label entirely or i had and it'd been subliminally stored in the back of my head but apparently well i know that it's used Making, made by entirely using, not entirely using, but the only hop variety they use are citra hops. God, I'll see, now I've got that light on, I can see this glass needs a bloody wash. What's going on with that? Sure I did. I spat in it anyway. <laughs> oh, see how it's gone dark? Now the beard's down the light. The dark, the light, the dark, the light. Better or worse? Better or worse? No one knows the answer to that. Oh, man. So, cheers. Citra by Oakham Breweries. 4.6%. 4.6%. See, I'm just messing about now because it's, um, it's got a bit, picture of a green face thing on it. It's quite a good summer beer, actually. If we had a summer, it snowed. <laughs> I didn't take a photo, there's about this much snow, this much, count it, see, see there, this, hang on. this much snow in a corner somewhere, right near a wall as I was walking past, and I was like, bloody, 
Arctic mayhem. May, that's all the traffic had come to us. We don't have got traffic here. Can't. Everyone's too drunk to drive, so we just don't bother. What it has got is grapefruit, plenty of grapefruit, but not the taste of grapefruit, but that thing when you've had a grapefruit and you've eaten a mouthful of grapefruit and suddenly about a minute later you go and you start swallowing the inside of your cheek. It's like that, really like that. So the more you drink of it, the drier your throat gets. So you just have another little bit, you have another little bit and soon it's all gone. So that's quite good actually doing it. So I've got that. So uh, yeah, Oakham from, where are they? Where are they? Peterborough. Nice work. I think Peterborough is there, I think, over there somewhere. I think slightly north, north, west, north, east, north, no, west, then, uh, north, west. I don't know. That, it's in that corner anyway. It's brewed in that corner. Tastes like it. No, it's actually very nice. And I'm enjoying it immensely. Well, got a bit of a busy weekend coming up as well this weekend. That's going to be fun. Um, on Saturday, I've got my old buddy Blaze coming over from Blazing Chaos Alcohol Band. He's the Blaze, I am the Chaos. Um, and uh, we've, we're mixing the final tune that needs mixing from this album we've been working on for, this project we've been working on for the last years or something like that. Um, and yeah, so we were, we were mixing a tune called uh, Better By Night, um, which is some big, starts off as a big sort of dirgy, sort of proggy, bombastic, and then halfway through it, it cuts in this very much lighter version of itself. Because lyrically it does that as well. It sounds a bit posh, doesn't it? We're talking about a bit arty. But no, it just, you know, and that's what happens, it's, it's a song of contrast, um, you know. There's a town that's better by night, because it's an absolute shithole. And there's a town that's better by day, because it's nice. And that's what we'd all like to be, apart from me, because I don't like going outside in daylight, because, you know, I look like a shithole. <laughs> so we're mixing that Saturday, and then there's going to be probably a few drinks after that too. If, I don't know if we'll get the whole thing done, but we get pretty much there. I've got a um, a bit of a problem with uh, drum machine software that I've mentioned before, but I've got the solution for that. I've just got to download a bit of kit, stick it in there, and uh, away we go. So that's cool. And then on Sunday, uh, gosh, that's great fruit, isn't it? I'm just drying up. Why do people? Why do people do that when they've had something and you're and, and they want to tell you what they think of it? Instead of just going, "Oh, that's all right," they just go, "Hmm, hmm, hmm, hmm." You haven't eaten it yet, you just went like that. Just with the... So, people like that, knobheads, basically, all freaking knobheads. So I'm getting into the swing of this again. I haven't done a video for a while, I haven't had a rant. I'm a bit out of practice. I've got the old gestures. Gestures, gestures. Um, yes, I was going to do the news, the politics. Uh, they're all bastards. All right, that's the news. Good. Carry on. Then on Sunday, did I say, did I do this bit? I've got to do it twice because of Brexit, apparently. Um, this is the European version. A la dimanche. Oh, is that Saturday, Sunday? I can't remember now. Sontag. Uh, no, Samstag. Sontag. I can't. It's a long while since I went to school. And, uh, you know, I didn't go to school in France or Germany either, so I don't know what I'm talking about. Um, on Sunday, I've, I've, apparently this is the American version. On Sunday... Uh, Matt, pr Matt, Matt, Preston from his, oh, Matt, not from Matt, 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 uh, Matt, Let's, I'll start again, who's this one for, 
No one knows. On the Sunday, 4.6%. Matt Preston from Matt's World of Cool Stuff is coming here to Disgrace Lands. Armed with guitars, an amplifier, a speaker, some beer, and something else which he's mentioned he's going to bring, which, you know, you'll see after the event, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll do a video on that after the event. So be excited, because I am. So, there's a beer festival down the road this weekend, so we've got to make sure I avoid that, because that would be just too messy. There's a beer festival in my fridge anyway, what the hell do I need to go out there for? And, um, we're going to be playing guitar and drinking beer and we'll try and do a video. I think last time we were just having too much of a laugh and just none of us actually remembered to press the play the record thing on the camera or whatever. But we'll try and have a go at doing that this time and, um, you know, bring you some of that. Uh, yeah. Other than that, the Arctic conditions outside, you know, grab a flat pick and do go back to basics. All of us, every single one of us who plays guitar could do with doing this. Um, because it's stuff like this we forget and it's only when you sit down and you really like analyse it you realise how bloody sloppy we let things get sometimes and it's just you know a matter of spending an hour or two doing something like that to really tighten things back up and get your brain thinking about it all again and uh, you know it's not good enough is it <laughs> it's not good enough just to say oh that's all right that'll do it's not it won't all right that's what makes some of us better than other people but the people that really do that that's why they're all better than me <laughs> so I'm just telling you about it. I didn't say I'm doing it, did I? So, there you go. I really have got archive. This thing, like, just, like... I am practising in case, you know. So, um, with that... I will see you on the next one. Take it easy. Bye!